Okay, there we go. I can't hear. Guys, it happened again. We have a new creature in the Jurassic Park expansion mod. This is the Ultimasaurus, which is basically a mixture of a Triceratops, a Rex, an Anki, and possibly some other creatures that I don't know that go into this thing. It's actually one of the coolest things I've ever seen. I remember there was an Ultimasaurus mod worked on a while ago, and it just didn't actually come to light. I think I tried it, and it crashed my game. And then I had to reinstall Ark and all of my mods because everything was completely broken. So I'm pretty happy that this one didn't do that because I was so scared to load my game. Someone did it right though. So hell yeah. Major props to the Jurassic Park expansion for bringing this thing to the game. Now I do know there are some things about this creature that aren't finalized. Apparently its roar is a placeholder and it does not have the correct sound yet. Now what do I mean by that? Well, one, the sound from what I understand is incorrect. It's supposed to have a different sound from this, and the roar is not supposed to stun creatures. It's actually supposed to have the Uteranus' effect where it makes them run away. Now this creature feels a little bit slow, but don't worry about it because it's probably going to make up for it in firepower. I'm hoping have good health. 4,500 health at level one is uh, pretty, pretty freaking good if I do say so myself. And we have a Spinosaurus right here and something just hit. What the? F okay, that's cool. Can I scare you away? Scare you away. Oh, wow. It actually affects the Spino too. Seriously? That is so cool. Anyways, guys, welcome back to Ark. Today we are messing around with the fancy little Ultimasaurus, and I do have something else I want to show you guys that I'm not 100% sure about, actually. Look at that, it actually scares the Spino away. My god. Do you know what kind of, how, how frightening it has to be to scare away a Spino? I'm just destroying everything, too. This thing's really strong. At level one, too. Spino's coming back for some more. Let me just see. Let's see if I can take on a Spino on this guy, because I'm only level one, and I don't have a saddle on. Hey, you! You want to fight? Yo, I just three-shot it. Level six Spino, too. Damn! Things per- Ooh, hi. What are you? You're metal. Ye can I- No, I don't scare you, really. Wait, do I have my C ability? Oh, I have an attack with my head! That is so cool! Holy crap, you can headbutt things with the trike horns. It's, that's actually really cool. I didn't I didn't even think of like trying to headbutt things with those horns. That's really cool. But like I was saying, I have something cool to show you guys too in just a couple minutes from a different mod. And it's some really cool armor sets. Now, I can't spawn them in. I tried and I don't even know if they are armor sets that they want to put in the mod. But like I saw it and I assume it's going to be something they add or it might be something that's in the works. I saw it on the mod workshop. So if you guys know anything about that, let me know in the comment section below. And as always, if you do enjoy Ark and you want to see more in the future, well then leave a like and let's get into it. Now what I was curious about was this mod right here. This is actually from the Prometheus mod. And I saw these cool armor sets. I don't know if they're an actual thing in the game or not, but like, you can see the chick right here using like some kind of Deathwing style armor. You got a crazy golden knight over here. You got some really nice, like, they almost look like, uh, I don't know, like angel warriors or something. And it looks like they're in some kind of tech place too or something. Now, I don't know if this is a player, like players with actual armor on, or if it's just some kind of like thing you spawn in the game and they're there for decoration or whatever. I, I kind of hope the armor is actually uh, a thing you can get or will be able to get in the future that, well, you can wear. Because that would be really cool. Especially this guy's armor over here. That is the most badass armor I have ever seen in Ark. And then this stuff right here too. It's pretty cool. It looks like it has angel wings too. And it all looks really good. I would love to see this armor in the game as a mod. Holy crap, dude. That would be amazing. You guys let me know what you think. I'm going to go back into the game and mess with my little friend. So one thing I'm kind of curious about is if these things can mate. Because, I mean, they're a new creature. And usually these new creatures, mod developers don't add the ability for them to have offspring. And the ultimate source, like having a baby would be adorable. Right? I mean, ultimate source baby. Come on. It's, it, it, it's kind of adorably terrifying, actually. <laughs> now that I think about it. I'm going to try and breed these guys just to see if they can. I do see enable wandering to mate. So I would assume they would be able to. I'm going to try it out and just see. Just give me a second, guys. Oh, wow, they do mate. Holy crap. Dude, you see that? 5.3%, 6.6. Holy crap. So then I guess it would have an Ultimasaurus egg, and then the egg would hatch into the 
baby, I'd assume. Oh my god, this thing is so cute! It's- oh, look at its little face, too! Look at that! It's- it's a little- it's a little lip sticking out! Oh my god, hang on, does it look the exact same for the parents, too? Holy crap, that is so cool! Hang on a second. Hey, look, I- I should be able to ride this guy by now! What are your stats? Oh, you're gonna be so big and strong, just like your parent- Just like your parents, watch! Watch a don't- don't you attack! Oh god! Oh god, they made me lag. What are they- come on, attack! Oh, they tried to headbutt! Dude, that is crazy! Look at these guys! Where are you going? Hey! Hey, 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 no, 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 no. Don't you go running off, little guy. You're gonna die if you go out there, okay? It's dangerous out there. <laughs> he looks so adorable! He has like a- he has like a overbite. <laughs> oh my god. You're so cute. So you can breed them then, that's kind of cool. So, I mean, te it's technically a fully functioning creature with the ability to breed. I don't know how... Uh, like, I feel like a creature with this much genetic... Oh my god, its eyes bopping out of its head. Oh my god, it's- it, one of its eyes are coming out. It's like super surprised, look at that, it's like, oh my god, where's- where am I? What is this place? Oh my god, I'm in so much pain! <laughs> it's just in crippling pain. I mean, I don't know, something messed with this thing genetically, and like, to have this many genetic modifications on your body, you know there's something going on in the family tree that just isn't healthy for your offspring. Like, I don't even think this thing should procreate, to be honest with you. Now, I am curious, what would the Ultimasaurus do against the V-Rex, which, from what I understand, is the Rex from Kong Skull Island, another custom creature in this mod. There's a lot of really well custom creatures in this mod, by the way. You should definitely check it out if you're interested in mods and, and custom creatures. I also think they changed the Allosaurus sound that was used from the Isle. Not sure on that one, but I did talk to the mod dev about that. Hey, 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 hey. You see- you see what happens now? There you- Oh my god, it roared and killed it. Your roar just killed a Dilo. Alright, so, yeah, I'm gonna get the V-Rex in here. I wanna see what happens with these two. Oh, okay, alright, or they could fight right away. So, I was gonna show you the stats of the V-Rex. Oh no, they're not gonna do that infinite circling thing, are they? Get away, you. It's gonna scare the crap- No, the V-Rex is a- What? Is the V-Rex really immune to it? Which, guys, this isn't an Indominus, just so you know. This is an actual, like, it's a different creature altogether. It looks like they're gonna fight. Hell yeah, look at that. That is crazy. Oh my god, it killed the V-Rex. It just straight up nuked that guy. So we know it could take on the V-Rex, but can it take on the I-Rex? The Indominus in this mod is actually pretty strong too. The Indominaraptor though, uh, in packs, can take down the Indominus Rex pretty easily. However, I'm gonna go ahead and players only. Now this guy is not tamed anymore. It looks like it's aggressive. It can't scare the Indominus and looks like the Indom actually got- That is- Wow! That was so cool! Look at that! I love how it actually does the alternate attacks and stuff, and actually tries to ram it with his head and knock it back. Look at that! That is- that is so cool! Like, it's the- it's more realistic to me. With fighting and stuff, because, like, we have the biting and running into the bodies and stuff, but it's so nice to see when they actually start using these alternate attacks and crap. I'm- I kinda wanna do something a little bit crazy. Give me a second. So what I've gone ahead and done is I brought in 100 Indominus Rex and 100 Ultimasaurus because I'm kind of curious to know who is the top mutated predator. You guys know the Indominus has a ton of different genes in it to make it a superior predator. Well, the Ultimasaurus also has a ton of genes in it. Now, it seems like the Indom might be a little bit bigger. The Indom resembles the V-Rex a lot more, actually, in my opinion. However, I know this might kill my game. <laughs> I'm kind of worried about the well-being of my computer and my GPU at this point. Oh, man. Guys, let me know who you think is going to win down in the comment section below. I think the Ultimasaurus is going to win personally because it has the extra attacks and it might have a little bit more health, actually. Either way, it's probably going to be loud, so let's get into it and get it done. Okay, there we go. I can't hear. I'm deaf. Holy crap, dude! Way too many! Way too many things going on! Oh my god, I think the Ultimasaurus is winning too! It's a never-ending screaming fest! Oh, it just abruptly stopped like that. Dude, holy crap, this is a giant army of them! Oh my god! 
Yeah, they don't stand a chance, do they? A lot of them are really bloody, though. We've got some indoms right there. I think they might have... No, they didn't scare the indom. Let me just move them all up right here. Everyone go! Oh, they know. They know something's about to go down. Oh, they might actually kill some of these. Holy crap, they just... What? They vaporized. Oh my god. I can't believe that just happened. There were so many of them. I'm gonna try another 100 indoms, I think. Here's another 100 indoms. Let's see. Oh yeah, the Ultimasaurus is gonna be doomed, I think. I love the screaming fest they have, though. Like, they have like a shout-off or something like a scream-off. The Indom scream and then the Ultimasaurus screams. And they both have really good roars, too. But I think I might have just brought in too much for the Ultimasaurus to handle. Yeah, I definitely did. I'm gonna reset because I want to try one more thing. Alright, so I spawned in 100 Indoraptors and 100 Ultimasaurus. Now, the Indoraptor seems to have an upper hand on even the Indominus. In the way of power and numbers. Well, power and numbers, I guess. So I want to see what happens with the Ultima when the Indoraptor... I bet it could scare it, actually. I bet I bet the Ultimasaurus could actually scare the Indoraptor. I didn't think of that. Actually, I think the Ultimasaurus is killing the Indoraptors so fast I'm not even keeping track of them. I don't even see them anymore. Where the... Is there some up there? No. Where the hell did they go? They just, like, ate them all. The hungriest beast ever. Holy crap, dude. So that, that answers that. <laughs> oh my god. They just... Okay, calm down. Whoa. Whoa. Whoa, what are you guys doing? What the hell was that all about, guys? You need to calm down. Is there something up there now? So I'm assuming if 100 can't handle the Ultimasaurus, I'm assuming 400 should be able to. That's what I just brought into the game. 400 of them. Sometimes they spawn in invisible, just so you know, because they have a camo ability. So I just want to make that clear that you might not see all of them. It might not look like 400, but it actually is. And that is really loud. They just killed one. Okay, I think now they're able to gang up on the Ultimosaurus, so they are standing a chance. But, I mean, there's a lot of them over here. There's a lot of them everywhere, actually. Oh, yeah, they're vaporizing a lot of these guys now. Power and numbers. Look at this. They're just savages. It's all they are. Barbaric. God damn. I didn't expect them to actually kill any of them, to be honest with you. I didn't think the ultimate source would even take damage. Wow, that's actually pretty incredible. Oh, there's a lot over here, though. There's a lot of them. There's a lot of Oh, yeah, they didn't stand a chance. I just wish the Ultimasaurus had a tail swing attack. I think that would be, like, the icing on the cake. It can attack with its horns. Cool, guys. I appreciate it. They can attack with its horns. And if it can swing with its tail and hit stuff like that, too, that would be really cool. Maybe even break legs or something. But, guys, that's it for the video. I hope you enjoyed it. Let me know your thoughts down below on the Ultimasaurus. And these giant battles. If you want me to do some more giant battles like this, let me know in the comment section below why you'd like to see... And I will see you in the next video.